Oh, hello, this little slime. How are you doing? I think you're doing dead. That is right. Right, so... Uh... Okay. Welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Survival. We are down here in the mines. Have I already... Wow, I've already got a full inventory. Uh, what do I get rid of? Uh, that grass block seems a bit unloved. We've got about 20 stacks of those. Yeah, we're starting this episode off down in the mine because I've been down here getting stone and I felt like, you know, I kind of needed to... I kind of felt like just going down here. Now, in the last episode, I'm pretty sure I ended off with 40 levels. But, on my way down here, I forgot I didn't have feather folding and I dropped down the staircase and died. So, mm-hmm. I'm a bit stupid, aren't I? But I've actually done a lot of work since the last episode on the base area. And by that, I've actually done some more progress on that butcher. And that's actually the reason I'm down here, to get stone for that butcher. And then I've also planned out a few more builds on top of that. So that's pretty cool. And I'm just going to leave that alone because I hate gravel. I'm pretty sure everyone hates it in terms of like when you're mining and stuff and it just, you know, gets in your way and, and all that sort of annoying stuff. Yeah, I'm kind of annoyed that I died, but it's kind of what I get for being a bit silly. Because, yeah, I'm just annoyed because I had 42 levels. So, uh, ugh. But anyway, yeah, I was going to keep mining and I'll probably come back when... I find something cool. Oh, I didn't even see that. I just started digging it and there's diamonds here. I mean, that's really nice. Give me those ores right now. Are there any others around? It ain't looking like it. It's just looking like we've got ourselves some redstone here. So, yeah. But we are on 11 diamond ore. And I have not been going for long at all which is very very nice so we're just gonna keep going and hope we find some cool stuff but i don't really intend on going for much longer to be honest because there are other things i want to do today honestly at this point i think i might just turn back and that is really because you know my pickaxe is getting low on durability and I kind of just feel like it is time to go back anyway. So, yeah. That kind of hit. And my like, lag is kind of getting a bit annoying as well. It's a bit silly if you know. That's what's what? I don't know. But anyway, we've got ourselves a few things which we might as well go and, you know, fortune mine. So... Mm-hmm, let's get ourselves the diamond ore, first of all. So, oh boy, some good old diamonds. It's always a nice thing to see diamonds in your Minecraft worlds. Hmm, 26, that is over double the amount, so I will not complain. We're selling alright at the minute on 46, so, mm-hmm. There's still a bunch of other rules though we need to mine, like this redstone for example. So we'll go ahead and mine this down. So I'm just going to go ahead and, you know, do this. You know, something random like that. And let's go ahead and mine the redstone and hopefully get a ton of XP back. So yeah, that's the mining trip. The main reason I went was so I could go ahead and do the walls for this thing which, and this looks a bit weird right now because I actually wanted to go ahead and you know just dot it with stone you know do a bit of the texturing action just like so to make the wall look a lot of for god's sake I've let's get the silk touch pickaxe out but yeah just, you know make it look a lot better the wall and we missed a spot apparently I like there we go anyway let's talk about this area which I have gone ahead and planned out this building right here this very large building 
is going to be a storage building. It's going to be mega storage. We're going to hopefully store a ton of items in here. And hopefully it's going to be pretty cool. Got ourselves these railing things. I was going to like connect them up with fences eventually. Don't know why I didn't do that. But mm -hmm, I didn't do that. This right here, judging by the fact there's a staircase. So I'm just going to go ahead and line up. This is actually going to be a mine. A brand new mine. It's going to be an automatic one. So you go ahead, you go down to the bottom. And then you put stuff in the minecart when you're done. And then you send it up and it's going to unload it into some chests or something. Something along those lines. I'm not entirely sure yet. And yeah, we've also gone ahead and over here planned out this little circle area. It's not, really a, it's not a circle, what am I saying? But it's an area, and this is actually going to be some custom terrain, which I will build at some point in the near future, but I will not do that today, as my main focus of this episode is going to be the good old butcher. So let's go ahead, and we're going to go and start, or we'll continue doing these walls now, and I'll come back when these walls have been finished. And I believe the walls are now in place, so if we go like over here and have a look at it, it looks pretty good. It looks kind of like a warehouse in a way. That's kind of what it looks like. And actually, to be honest, uh, now that I look at it, at first I thought it was kind of good, but, hmm, at the minute... I'm not that sure. Uh, I feel like there are some improvements that we could make to this. And I've got a bit of an idea as to what I could do. So maybe I'm going to have a bit of a play around with some wood here. And see if I can use wood to make this thing look better. Alright, so I have literally gone ahead and implemented like a wooden beam underneath the wall part on, uh, at the roof and honestly, I think that makes the build look a lot better. So I'm going to go ahead and implement this to the other parts, you know, where I can. Alright, so I think I have gone ahead and done it now for all of them. That it looks a lot better now, I will say. It is definitely looking a lot better. I am a fan. I am a fan indeed. Well now, we can go ahead and put all our stone bricks away. Because we didn't actually need that much. And we have way too much stone bricks. We're also going to put our stone away. The stuff I'm putting in here is going to be... Just so I know where to block off this like roof part, so I'll be a minute. Alright, so I'm here on a copy of the world, and I have indeed built a chicken cooker right here. And the good thing is, once the chicken cooker is up and running, we can go ahead and, you know, block off the ceiling around, maybe we do it up here. You know, on line with the bottom of the wall, so don't know why I just went to my inventory. I can just go ahead and pick block. But maybe we can go ahead and block the ceiling off around up this area here. You know, like this. And then mm -hmm, maybe we get some light up there first of all. So mobs don't spot the top. Which won't happen because it's the top half of a block. So, yeah, maybe we just block it off there uh, before we get our chickens in. So, yeah, and then the next thing we're going to have is an auto smelter, which will definitely fit in the space, so it's all fine. Alright, so what we can go ahead and do is maybe just start planning out the area in which this build is going to be going in. So, I think... This 4x3 area is exactly what we were going to need. So there we go. I think we have ourselves the perfect area for it now. And we can begin 
building this thing, which is pretty cool. So we're gonna go ahead now and get all the things that we need. Let's begin building by placing down a chest, and then a hopper, and I forgot a slab. Ah, but it's fine, because I've got a wood slab, so that will do the trick. Uh, I do not have a lava bucket though. Uh, where's the nearest lava? Yeah, I just placed a ton of blocks, so what? Anyway, we need to go ahead and get ourselves a dispenser in here. Just like that, and then the dispenser comes like this, and then like that, and then the lava comes in like a second, it will come in anyway. Oop. And then we do that, get rid of that, get rid of that, 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 get rid of that and that. This is a very simple farm. We need to go ahead now and get ourselves our hopper. We can place the lava in now. And then we can go ahead, get ourselves our slabs and stuff. Get ourselves that like that. And then we just need to go ahead, get that in there, and that in there. And I believe all we need to do is we need to make sure the chickens can't get up by doing that, that, and that. Boom. There we go. I believe the farm is nearly ready now. Just to go ahead and tidy this thing up. So there we go. Just need to go ahead now and put in all the complicated redstone stuff. And I forgot to get an observer. Alright. We have our observer now. All we need to do is go ahead put that like that. Go up here. We need to get ourselves on like the end of here. I need to figure out what I'm doing this. Uh, need my comparators. Yep, just like that. Seems good. Uh, then we can go get, we can, no, we don't want to get rid of that actually. Oh god. Um, that's looking good. Just go ahead and put that in like that. And then we go ahead and do that. And then we do that. And boom. I believe. The farm is done. That's literally all it is. It's a very simple farm. All we need to do now is go ahead and, you know, block this off. So, maybe in here, instead of one chest, we go ahead and add a second. If we just got ourselves a nice crafting table in here, that would make things a lot easier for us. Just plonk it in this corner. There we go. There we go. Get rid of that. Can't have any uh, dirt in here. Boom. It's in place. It's going to go ahead now and block all this off. We need to get ourselves some of our things right here. Some stairs. There we go. Those back. Wrong place. Really? There we go. And now we need to go ahead and block every other angle of this off. And this will be very dark on the inside, so maybe I go ahead with the torches and just do that so nothing spawns. Up you come. Up you come. Come on. I know you want to. Come up here, boy. And there we go. I'm going to actually breed you two as well. Yeah, you want to do your stuff? You want to do your stuff? Make the little child? Yeah, yeah, make the little child. Make him? Hello? Um. I'll leave you to it. Yeah, I'll. Did I only give them what? Uh, whatever. But yeah, we've got ourselves some chickens now for this farm, which means it is now up and running. And I might go ahead and see if 
I have any seeds. Uh, there's none in there. Alright, so I think I've got myself a nice floor in here. I've also gone ahead and put like spruce log outline along the top just to make it all match on the inside and to make it all look good. Now I think maybe we go ahead and have the ceiling a bit lower in here or something to, you know, map to not make this thing look ugly. And we've even got ourselves a chicken in there now. No chickens have died just yet because this thing isn't too efficient right now because it obviously doesn't have much chickens in. Don't know why those guys weren't breeding when I fed them 20, 10 seeds each basically. It's a bit strange. But yeah, I think maybe we go ahead now and just do this as a ceiling. I don't care that I place that there. We've still got... Oh. We don't have any more slabs, but we do have over a stack of logs, so it's all good. So we can go ahead now and fill this in. Yeah, now we can get ourselves these hoppers in. So we can go ahead and go... Uh-huh. Huh, huh. Did we get it in? I don't think we did. Huh and ha. Huh. Then we go ha, 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 ha. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Ha, 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 ha. Yes. And then ha, 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 ha. Mm-hmm. Where'd my... Okay, there we go. Oh, then we go, mm-hmm, 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 yay, it's done, nearly, maybe we get ourselves some sort of like staircase at the back here, which like allows us to go like, you know, and check and put in stuff, like a maintenance staircase. You know, something like that, and then we come along the top like this. Mm-hmm. And then maybe we just wrap it around. So like this, you know. Alright, so I'm currently in the process of just going ahead and, you know, defining a storage system here. So maybe we go ahead along the top. And just do ourselves some logs, kind of go into there, you know, something like that. And now we can just expand this, you know, all the way up. And I don't know what the time of day is. It's 10 tonight. Right. I also believe it is a bit dark in here, so... Yeah, just something like that. Okay, let's get this back out and we can go over to here and then implement this thing. Because, yeah, and here maybe we do it. Mm hmm. Looks like a good thing. It's like a nice thing. Got ourselves a ton of flowers. We need to empty our inventory a bit though, because it's rather full. I do not like it when the inventory is full. Alright, so while our clay is smelting up, we can go ahead and install the door, first of all. So while we maybe do AFK sessions in here to get more food, we can do it in peace. Now, anyway, we can maybe do lantern. Get rid of the torches, buy the lantern. Then we have a flower pot, and then we have a lantern, maybe. That seems like a cool thing. Lantern, flower pot, lantern. Hello, any is only one piece right now, yep. I think this will be enough. There we go, coming here. <clears throat> you know, place our flower pots. We only needed two in the end, apparently. Okay. Uh, we can go ahead and maybe do a sapling and a sapling. Yeah, mm-hmm, cool. Can you put, can you put, I don't think you can, but can you put flower pots on leaves? No, you can't. I was going to try using a poly, polished granite slabs, like that, as like a workstation. And I have a bad feeling, let me just do that. 
Uh, no. Alright, never mind. I thought maybe for a second the uh, eggs were all getting all stuck in, in the dispenser, but it doesn't look like they are. I think, anyway, we can get ourselves some like item frames. Oh god. Alright, so I decided, because I couldn't find any pigs, I mean I'd only been looking for about five seconds and found a ton of sheep. So, I've decided that that this is going to be the best decision. I don't know really which way around this should be. You know, maybe we just do it like that. You know, something like that. Um. Uh, what stage is it? Okay, so we're gonna like do it in like a cycle sort of thing. So like that, and then we do that, and then we do ours like that, and the one after like that. It's like a foot. It's literally just like a foot. Hmm. There we go. And then it's upside down. Something like that. And we can maybe even put like some stone cutters on the end here. What the heck? Why is the wall all dark? Okay, that was, that's weird. Very weird. I'm a bit confused. Yeah, there we go. Uh, actually... What if I do it like there instead? And we get ourselves this and we do that like that to make it look like a conveyor belt. Ooh, to make it look like a table actually. Ooh, actually. Ooh. I'm a fan. Yeah, I like it. Yeah. That's actually very nice. I don't know why I like that so much. Those little touches just add so much to the build sometimes. And yeah, that is probably going to be it for today. So thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, then obviously that's cool. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.